on most cars it's very easy to uh, see how much wear is uh, on the brake pads uh, it mostly depends if you can have a uh, well spokes that uh, have a gap large enough just use a small uh, flashlight but sometimes you don't even need a flashlight and if you look here we have the brake disc we have the brake pads the brake pads has two materials this is the base the metal base of the pad and this that touches the disc is the wear material you notice in this situation the wear material is about the same thickness as the base plate so there is a lot of material left when you see this brake uh, material here this part here going maybe as thick as this road maybe two three millimeters then you'll need to replace the pads so it's very very easy to look at these cars um, also if you want to look at the disc itself the wear it's usually will show as this area here T don't touch this guy when you drive the car because it's going to be very hot my car uh, has been parked now but when it wears out this area here will go deeper and you will notice an edge here look at the inside circle and try to touch the edge if you feel it's more than two millimeters then the disc needs replaced also if it's very badly scored rusted or so but the pads is really easy to see again as far as the camera can go you notice the inner material of the part and the base plate 